Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. If you're new in here, my name is Andrea Ali and I'm a professional makeup artist based in Paris. In today's video, I'm going to talk about the YSL Touche Cla All-in-One Glow Foundation. I'm going to tell you everything about this product and I'm also going to show you how it applies. And then we're also going to dig into the Rouge Volupté Shine Lipstick Balm from YSL. This video is in partnership with YSL. I'm incredibly grateful and excited to do this video. I think you guys are going to like these two products, but like I always say, when I'm reviewing products, especially makeup products, they kind of speak for themselves. So I cannot wait for you to see how the foundation applies, how the lipstick applies, the texture, the finish, everything is pretty noticeable when it comes to makeup. And in this video, I also got you very close to my skin so you get to see what it really looks like up close. With no further ado, let's get into this video. I'm gonna start with the foundation. I've already applied some eye makeup and this is the YSL Touche All-in-One Glow Foundation. I like the packaging, it's not too heavy. However, it looks very luxurious because of the golden accents. And then it does have a pump which is always very practical and easy to use. It is a one Oz, a 30 milliliters product in here. And my color is B30, which I looked up at the website and they say this is for light skin with neutral to golden undertones. That's how I would describe my skin when I don't have a self tan on. It's neutral, but then it has golden and olive undertone. So this color B30, you will see that it matches perfectly with my skin. I've got combination skin which means I'm very oily on the t-zone and I'm pretty dry on the cheeks. This foundation is oil-free and it provides a lot of hydration. So if you have normal dry combination or mature skin, I think that this will make a great foundation for you. In terms of coverage, this is a light to medium coverage and it's buildable, meaning you can start with a very thin layer and then you could build applying a little bit more with a brush, with your fingers or with a sponge. All of these three options would work. Okay, now let's get into the application. And now I know that you guys don't like when the hair is down. Let me apply it directly onto the skin. And then I'm taking a brush. and buff it into the skin. I always make sure that I spread the foundation down the neck and if my hair is up, I get it right here and very, very close to the hairline so that it just blends seamlessly. I'm going to spread this foundation under my eyes as well as I just want to see the power of its coverage. I want you to see the finish of this foundation. This is very glowy, very luminous. Uh, it's hydrating but not greasy. It doesn't feel or look greasy. It has a very luminous finish on my skin and like I said, I am combination skin definitely did not hide all my you know little imperfections like right here you can see it. but it did exactly like promised which is even out my skin tone give me a beautiful glow i mean you guys this is a perfect foundation for every day if you are looking for something that you could just apply fast with your fingers with a sponge or with a brush whatever you prefer because it's also a mistake proof kind of a foundation has a very light weight finish texture that just blends seamlessly into your skin and gives you like i said this really pretty glow skin feels very very much like skin and i really think it did a great job under the eyes I do like to set my makeup in place, especially the T-zone, and I'm going to use this YSL All Hours Setting Powder, and this is in the color B20. I 
and I set the makeup in place wherever I know that my skin produces the most oil and that is usually uh, the center of my forehead, nose, sides of the nose, definitely. I always get oily right here and a little bit on the chin. I'm back, I've applied a little bit of bronzer and now I'm going to talk about the star of this video which is Rouge Volupté Shine Lipstick Balm. This lipstick is formulated with more than 60% oils. This is the type of lipstick that is almost like skincare but for your lips. It's so nourishing, so hydrating. My first purchase was the number 44, the Nude Lavalier, which is a pinkish brown, this one right here. But then I love the formula so much, so I had to buy another one. And I'm gonna show you the other color that I got. But let me apply first number 44, Nude Lavalier. Look at this glide. This feels so good, you guys. I could I could keep on doing this. You guys know me when I like a lipstick and when I love the texture, I'm like, keep on applying and applying and applying. A great thing about this is that because it is formulated with so many oils, it's going to keep your lips hydrated. And in time, if you keep using this, you're going to feel a difference in your lips. They're going to be smoother, more hydrated. If your lips are very dry, this is really going to help. This color is just fantastic. It's an easy lipstick. I could apply this without actually looking into the mirror. It's just mistake proof, you know? Such a beautiful everyday color. I like that the lips look like they're, you know, they're alive. They have this beautiful shine. Uh, they look very like plump and very sexy. Why not? But more than that, they look healthy. You could definitely tell by my face. I love this product. I, lo I love the color as well very much, not just the formula. The lipstick itself, I mean, you guys, it's why I sell. It's so chic, it's so classy, beautiful, the gold and uh, yeah, the small YSL details on them. It's just beautiful. Okay, and if you guys like um, hydrating lipstick, you should definitely check this out. There were a lot of good colors to choose from but I had to put my hand on the 81 Coral Aviator, which is a beautiful deep coral. I thought it's a color that looks good with, my, with the color of my hair and my skin tone. Let me take this one off and apply the deep coral. Oh my God. Oh my god, it goes on like butter, feels exactly like it looks, so luxurious. I like this color so much, it puts such a big smile on my face. This color definitely works for a lot of skin tones and especially now where we are, you know, at the end of summer, beginning of autumn, uh, we all have that slightly sun-kissed skin and if you don't you know you could always use a little bit of bronzer to warm up your skin and like i said the texture is so beautiful so comfortable it's not heavy so it's not one of those hydrating high shine lipsticks that you when you do this you know they're sticky and you could almost like feel them right here not at all maybe i'm gonna go get some other colors because i really love this one of those lipsticks that you can literally put in your bag apply it wherever you are like it pampers your lips almost all right guys i've let my hair down so i don't look crazy anymore and this is what the lipstick looks like a little bit further away in love with it i think you guys are gonna like it too you have the link of the foundation and the lipsticks 
in my description box so go check that out and i've also made a selection of the colors that i think you guys would love natural everyday colors thank you so much for watching this video thank you ysl for partnering with me in this video i'll see you guys in my next one bye say hi oh are you shy are you shy or are you sleepy? Alfie, stop snoring. Help me out in here.